Yo, what's up guys? My name is Bellum and today we're going to check out what has happened so far in this season. Um, our new zone just opened up, um, level 2 pass. Uh, if you guys know Season of Strife map, um, this, this pass doesn't really mean anything. It's only from the home region. Um, it's really about the next few passes that's really going to uh, shake up things. But yeah, as, as far as you can see, like this pass, it won't be really much because everybody's just coming from their home region into the, not the home region, but their starting zone one uh, stuff into the next region. Um, yeah, as you can see, but I'm going to be talking about uh, what has happened so far as I've already made a preparation, as you can see here. Um, this is what has been going on. So, for example, these arrows are from LTS where we have moved towards and started building towards and taken over uh, basically two uh, free zones. Uh, but I'll talk about that later. Um, as you can see, NN has not entered this zone. They have taken the gates, but that's about it. They haven't even built any flags in that zone. Um, I forgot its name, but it doesn't really matter. Um, but as you can see, I've put a little sword down here. That means there has been fighting going on there. Um, but yeah, I'll talk about that later as well. Um, but as you can see, it's pretty... Um, yeah, for us, it's really been boring. And uh, this next zone is, is boring as hell as well. Um, I hope the enemy does show up for the statues, but we'll see about that. Um, yeah, we just have to see, I guess. Um, only time will tell but so far they've been absolutely um, avoiding us and trying to not fight us and starve us to death by boredom basically um, but yeah as you can see uh, there's been fighting going on over here and over here but this fighting is actually pretty interesting um, it's also not kinda but I will explain right now um, as you can see, their fighting is going on right here. Is this the right place? This is not. Did they change colors? I swear to God, they were all the colors earlier on. This really confused me. But now they're pretty much the same color, which is really annoying. But as you can see, it's uh, RAC right here. Uh, another RAC tower. And we've got SRF, which is basically RSC as well. But I'm pretty sure I've seen some lob players as well around here. So they have been fighting uh, together. Uh, because they are in a warband. So they can ally each other or they can port on each other's... Um, um, uh, you know what I mean. Uh, but while right here we've got free to play. And as you can see their allies are A to A, D to D and RAC. And NN, of course, is their family. That's their home kingdom. But really interesting, as you can see, because if you look up here, so NN and free to play, these two are allied. A2A, D2D are also allied with them. And then you've also got RAC and SRF, which really means us left alone and LOP left alone. Because LOP is in the same uh, warband as RAC, making it kind of weird, really. And even if we were to ally with Lop, they'd be on the other side of the map so we can't really help them in any way so as far as i know we don't have any allies for our alone on this season um but now we get to the interesting part so they have been fighting only just about here these have been pretty friendly mock fights both have both sides because this is nn uh, i'm pretty sure when the time runs out free to play is gonna take it and rac's got uh, a thunder rock right here but then we look at this side, we see yeah, free to play, they move out of their gates, not even a flag bill, and we just took over two free rocks. Um, pretty much the same on this side, they didn't show up, they only put one flag here, I don't know why, and they've only put one flag here just for this village. Uh, there has been some fighting over here, because there are, this is a D2D um, gate. So if they want to fight here, they have to join join D2D. Uh, but if they didn't, they would get rallied by us. Um, but yeah, as you can see, our flags are only here. They aren't really closer. So it, it was a pretty long walk time. Um, 
but yeah, the fights were pretty boring, so I didn't really record them. Um, you didn't really miss anything there. Uh, but then we've got to the interesting part. Here we've got um, Lop versus A2A and D2D. And um, this wasn't really close. A2A just wiped the floor with them. They rallied some bases. Um, so you can really see they aren't allied there or not or don't even have an aggression pack. They're just full enemies, which is kind of interesting because they are in the same warband with RAC and they are in the same alliance. Um, so that's kind of interesting. So that really tells you Lop is in a really weird spot. Um, Lop is in the same uh, home kingdom, by the way. I assume you guys already know that. Um, but yeah, so A2A just took... Um, this thunder rock and they gave t 2 d this thunder rock um so they both have at least one thunder rock because they both miss these two because uh, they left it uncontested um but yeah it's that's that's the season so far uh we're gonna see who's gonna come to these uh statues over here got statues over here and here and these gates um yeah, I don't know. I hope Gates 4 opens really soon because it's really been boring. Um, but that's the season so far. I can't make it any better. I'll try my best. But uh, I hope you guys understand and have a good picture of right now of how the season is progressing. Um, but yeah, that's it so far. If you want to see anything else or have a suggestion of what you want to see, you can always uh, let me know. Goodbye.